Very good morning my friends, how are you? Hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new deal of the day video from Extreme Trader. This is Salah speaking. So again, we are still with the gold and we are going to continue trading the gold this week so far. So the, the first thing we can notice on the gold that right now it's on a resistance level and actually it has been really overbought. So therefore we can expect right now to start shorting the gold. Now there is a reason behind of that. Let me just show you something. Now, if we draw here a resistance trend line like that, we can notice that the resistance has been breaking out from after seeing this bullish breakout candle and the pair actually has reached the resistance level on 1,900. Now, what I'm telling you always that this is the science in Forex. Whenever you see a bullish breakout from the resistance trend line, the, the breakout is going to hold this, the position until it reached the nearest res previous resistance. And after that, it's going to fall to retest the broken resistance, uh, resistance trend line and it's going to become a new support trend line. And after that, most likely what is going to happen that the gold actually going to continue the rise. However, today, Friday, we are actually looking for shorting the gold and we can see the first thing here happened. Let me sh just show you this on the four hour time frame. Actually, I'm going to be honest with you. This morning, I was planning to send you the signal to short the gold right from this level of the resistance at 1884. However, I was late and I didn't really want to rush because it was about six hours uh, earlier than now. So, however, um, the first thing we can notice right here that the pair actually is uh, retesting the broken resistance. Let me just show you right here exactly. So we can see that this resistance has been broken, uh, has been retested already. However, uh, the pair doesn't seem to be able to hold the position as I told you it has to fall down more uh, since it has reached the overbought level and most likely the gold is actually going to continue the fall so we just need to look where we can start shorting the gold again so going back to the 15 minute time frame we can notice that we are having right here the price is holding the position right here uh, on 1886 we can see that the pair has actually made so many attempts to break out from that level However, it kept failing and I, st I think it's going to continue failing uh, to break out from that level, especially if we draw right here a resistance trend line like that. In other way, uh, sorry, in other words, that means that actually selling the gold right here, exactly right here, is actually going to be a good idea. So we can short the gold at 1884 and the trade is actually going to have a stop loss just uh, on the top of that uh, resistance level. So... Uh, let me just tell you that uh, the signal to short the gold sell at 1884.22 and the stop loss is going to be right here at the top of the resistance so the stop loss is going to be actually 120 pips uh, let's try to reduce it that's better so the stop loss is the uh, 1893.81 Meanwhile, the take profit is actually going to be good because we are looking for the retest of the broken uh, support, uh, sorry, the broken resistance, as I said before. And this strong support level is actually going to be the target where I'm expecting the price to fall down to retest it. So the target is actually going to be 200 pips, which is really fair enough. And I think everyone will be happy with the take profit. So the take profit 1864.56. Uh, again, guys, please, just because the signal coming from Extreme Trader doesn't mean it definitely gonna be profitable. There is always a, that chances or possibilities that, that the signal might fail. So therefore, please be extra careful and be wise with your money, especially it's Friday. And deal of the day is just a good signal and a good deal that I'm seeing and I'm advising everyone to trade it. However, always there is a reason to, to placing the stop loss. So please be careful and be wise about your money management. So in the end, I hope that was a good, uh, what was, what was the ending? I hope that was informative to you and I would like to thank you for watching.